Oh dear. <laughs> um, yeah, I hope I'm streaming and uh, yeah. This is only a test run there, guys. It's a permadeath, uh, go what the? Uh, save. Oh, crap. Oh, now it worked. But I didn't get it. Unless, you know. Let's see if I got anything in the um, engineering department. Uh, one plastic, okay. Uh, so it's working. Anything else in this thing? I don't think so. Oh. So yeah, guys, this is Pamela. Um, new game. It's early access. It's been out for about a year now, or it's been released as an early access for about a year now. And I've been playing for playing this for a bit. And the reason why I'm sort of clunky is because I'm using controller because of my arthritis. And that's why it took me a really long time to learn the controls and whatnot. And I still haven't got the grips of it. Anyway, these are uh, cryo bays, and there's about five of them here. <clears throat> and uh, as you uh, watch, you'll see. Uh, uh, what they're all about. Now you missed the start of this game so if you want to see the start of the game I'd suggest you see uh, Jaya that's all capital uh, letters J-A-Y-A -A, and um, have a nice day in just ordinary uh, uh, maybe uh, letters or whatever. Uh, uh, Inferno. <laughs> now, Inferno, that's really hard, so I'm not going to touch that one. Now, that was a hacking, uh, hackable uh, um, thing. No, I'm not going to touch it. No. Better get in the habit of scanning a little bit more. Something. One item at the office. Oh, what's this? Um, activate, deploy, move, link. So, how do I? Ah, oh, cool. So, that's one thing I've got that's uh, a good start. A shield. Ooh, what's this? Nice, 144 lux. Well, I'm really off to a good start. The lux uh, will be eventually be, uh, usable at the uh, vending machines, and I'll show you where the vending machine is. Uh, there it is. Oh, wow, it's going. Normally, when I get to the vending machine, it's not going. Anyway, that's where you spend your credits. Now let's get back to uh, have I been here? I've been in there, so let's go to the next one. <clears throat> hey, my watch is not working. There we go. Plastic. Now, eventually, if you come back here, you'll get uh, some more stuff. I don't know what the spawn respawn rate is, but eventually, uh, every now and then, I find new stuff here. Shortly after I awoke, I asked the technicians why I couldn't feel my hands. Their blank faces offered no answers. And that is an echo. And you got, I think there's a 150 odd plus echoes. And this, I've got to find the code for that. And uh, yeah, it's uh, part of the actual mystery to actually what's going on here. Now, if you didn't, now because you didn't see the start, you're going to miss out a lot of um, information about this game. So again, 
I advise that you go to see JR. Have a nice day. That's a, a, all in one sentence you could say, but uh, the first word is in capital letters, spelt J A Y A. All right. So what's happened in this world is there's a strange infliction, and uh, it's seriously compromised all the citizens. And uh, yeah, <clears throat> I think I've got everything. Oh, what's that? Nice! All right. Now, let me pick that up. If you're playing permadeath, this, as it is in my case, I'm playing permadeath at the moment, is really, really important to get into one of these cryogen uh, things. That way, when you accidentally do get killed, you will... I don't know how to do it. Um... Uh, let me. I think it was I. Wonder. Wait a minute. What happened to? The, what happened to my cryogen? Emergency lamp. I thought that was a cryogen. I'm pretty sure I, I collected it. Huh. Really? That sucks. Did I accidentally just demolish it? I must have. Now this game has got a few jerks in that. Even though you've got a really beefy system, don't expect uh, to have a smooth thing. Alright, what's this? I think I'm at a disadvantage here um, using the controller because I think I'm demolishing things instead of picking them up. I need the code for that. I've read that. I'm pretty sure I have. All right, let's get on to the next room. I think I've uh, completed the actual uh, thing here. Let's have a look at status. Oh my goodness. Three o'clock already. Or well, 3.10. And the reason why I'm panicking is because at night we got these uh, seekers or dark seekers that come out. And they give you health. Got to make sure I've got to keep near things that I can jump on. But uh, I'm sure, as the developers find out about the little quirks of the game, <coughs> they're going to fix it or plug it up so that you <laughs> can't actually jump on the furniture and get away from the seekers or well, the dark seekers anyway there's good seekers and dark seekers well you'll find out as you uh, watch <sighs> and the reason why I'm scanning a lot is because uh, if pays to do that because it reveals um, all the goodies that you can have. Yeah, this is a hackable window. Do you need directions? No, I don't. Oh, what's that? I need some more credits. Oh, what's that? Air? At least I'm getting a lot of food in this um, <clears throat> in this uh, run. I don't know, I think I've done this room to death. Alright, so we were the I saw some I saw some toilets somewhere, didn't I? I'm pretty sure I saw some toilets. Maybe. 
Yeah, I didn't see him. I'd seen him in a previous game. So I play this a fair bit because I, you know, as I said, I'm trying to learn the controls. I think there was something in that bin there because it was highlighted. Go get a males, was it? Means? Uh, turkey jew. Now, this has got a crafting. Um, uh, side of the game so you can craft your own weapons if you don't find them or you can actually um, uh, yeah, craft them and a lot of things you can either find or craft if you don't find them initially you may be forced to craft them and every time you play, replay the game it's a little bit different Banana, pretty sure it's I need all the food I can get What was that? Kale. Oh, kale C, but. I'm a bit painfully slow, but as I progress and start playing this game on a daily basis, it should speed up. Oh, more credits. Yes. So 19 there. Tell you what, I may be getting a lot of food, but I'm not getting Have anything nice that's day. really handy later on. Uh, grab this. More glass. Uh, I don't know. I think I'll wait. I can do medium and easy reasonably good, but hard and inferno. Woo! Then I'm in trouble with that. There is no need to hurry. Yeah, right. No need to hurry. I listened to her and took me time, sweet time. A new wing was added to Ark Medical. The permits state it is to further research the decaying genetic material found in residents. Is that the key card to that room? Um, let's have a look. No, I don't think so, I can't see anything here. What's that? Candy Glimmer. Ah. Let's go to engineering. So I've got two plastic, one glass, and that's all I got. Sweet FA. Now let's have a look at my status. Jeez, I'm already thirsty and hungry. I'm uh, almost due for a bit of a, uh, a drinky and a bit of a neat. I've got 211 lux or credits. Well, at least I'm getting a lot of food. I won't die from starvation on this run. What's that? Cryo storage. That's what I'm after. And credit. Nice. Alright. Now I should be able to get into that room. Now... This has got to run for a little bit. I'm not running because when you run, I suspect you're going to end up uh, losing a bit of um, 
of your hydration and whatnot. Yeah, okay, so it's, oh, that changes all the time. Uh, six, that's jump. Six, six, zero, zero. Enter. All right. Oops, got to hit open. And of course, the fucker's locked. Is it easy or hard? Medium. I'll see if I how I go. Ah! 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 Nah. I am too slow. You're gonna have to forgive me, guys. <laughs> I be an old man, so you know. Well, I'm not an old man, but pushing seventy here, so. I find it it I'm gonna sort of I'm gonna have another go. Wait, what? Wait. You only get one chance at that? Oh, it must be have a timeout or something. Oh that's the first time I've come across a timeout. Uh, what time is it? Uh, uh, six o'clock. Um, yeah, I think it's a, I've got an, an hour and something to come across, or at least get to the end of this corridor. That's one thing I don't like about this game. I reckon Permadeath should have a little bit more time, like start earlier. Well, the one where you, you know, if you don't have the permadeath. Whenever the sun rises and the cyanotrope begins to glow faint blue, I'm reminded that only a day, not a decade, has passed. So as I was saying, you know, for the permadeath, you need more time. While the other game, I mean, if you die, you know, it's not as critical. These dark seekers, I mean, I gotta keep an eye on the time. And every time I look, keep an eye on the time, oh, look at that. 1900 already. Goodness. So it's 7 o'clock. Yeah, I gotta go back. I simply gotta go back because I've got no. I've got no um, protection at all. I've got no weapon. So let's grab all these things. And I'll quickly quit this and then I'll quickly go back. Yeah. I'll have quickly. Whenever the sun rises and the cyanotrope begins to glow faint blue, I'm reminded that only a day, not a decade, has passed. Oh, already. Am I going the right way? No, I'm going the wrong way. I got turned around. <clears throat> yeah, I got squat this time around. Jeez, Baloo. Like the first game, the very first time I played this game, I was looking around for it everywhere and I got nothing. And when I broke into um, the canisters, I got nothing. So I don't know, maybe this game has some issues where you first play it. The random things that you get is just not enough. Oh mate, I died so many times. You wouldn't believe how many times I've died. Of course, time flies when you're having fun. <laughs> okay, well, so far I haven't met up with any of the enemies or foes. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna make it uh, a short one. And I am going to finish up here, guys. And now I'm going to finish up also jumping up on here on this cabinet. 
Because for right for now, this is a safe place to be if you haven't got the cot. And in the next uh, episode, so yeah, you will find out what, what the cot's all about and why it's essential you need the cot. Like, thank you for uh, watching. And uh, yeah, these uh, videos will actually be short because of the fact that, uh, you know, uh, I haven't got the cot yet. Once I get the cot, they may be a bit longer. But for now, th these videos will be short. So yeah, thanks for watching and I uh, hope to catch you in the next video go uh, there, guys. Uh, bye for now.